Hi friends, this is Carmen. Welcome back to my channel. Today I've got a quick video for you of some new house plants that I purchased uh, both online and at the local nursery. So let's get started. As you can see here, I have the infamous Pelea peperomoideus, I believe it's pronounced. Well, we all know it as Pelea. And I have been looking for this plant for a while. It's not that I haven't been able to find it, but I had not been able to find it at a reasonable price. I just could not bring myself to spend 40, 50, 75, even $100 I've seen them selling for on a plant that, you know, I could possibly kill. So that was just not an investment I was willing to make. But recently I found through Etsy although they have their own website, but I went through their Etsy shop, uh, Hertz Nursery, they're out of Ohio, and I'll put a link below to their Etsy shop, and I found this plant in their shop for $19.99. Now that was a price that I was willing to pay, and it came in a four inch pot. It even came, as you can see there, with a little baby. Now these are known for giving off babies or pups and propagating easily. So when I opened it up, I was so happy to see that I'd already had one growing in its little pot here, which is wonderful. Now they packaged the plant very well. There was no um, dirt that was uh, coming out or in the box or anything like that. The only problem I think I have with the plant is some of the leaves you can see here are damaged. Now this damage I do not believe happened in transport or shipping to me. I believe that happened at their greenhouse. Um, there's another one here, there's a couple of leaves, but overall the plant is in very good shape. It was very well watered. It came in a plastic sleeve so the moisture was retained and uh, I haven't even watered it. The uh, soil is still moist from their nursery. It came very quickly too. Um, I ordered this on, let's see, Wednesday evening and I got it Saturday. So it came very, very quickly. It also came with a heat pack. Now I live in Arizona, so I didn't even think to order a heat pack, but they put one in because I guess Back in Ohio, you guys are having some very cold weather, so they did put a heat packet, no charge to me, in the box. So I have not selected yet a pot for this one to go in, but I will very soon. And um, if you have one of these plants, I'd so much appreciate some uh, advice please leave some advice for me down in the comments section as to what you've done to maintain your Palea um, and to really give it uh, its best chance possible. So I really appreciate that. Um, from what I've seen, it does do well in indirect uh, bright light, medium light. So that's probably what it will have. I think I'm gonna put this in my bedroom uh, window. That's where it would get that best kind of light. And we'll see how it does. Now I did order something else from Hertz and I had not heard of these, but this is a Peperomia, a stilt Peperomia, uh, scientific name Peperomia puteolata. And these are great for fairy gardens. Now, the listing was, put that up a little bit. The listing was for two plants at $5. So I thought that was a really good deal. And these remind me of the Peperomia, the watermelon one. It kind of looks like that same design on the leaf, although, those leaves are smooth. These have an actual grooves or texture to them. So um, 
there's a there's a different um, look to them and they start off as you can see there Let me try and get this to focus a little better you can see there that it it's uh, starts off in a maroon color and then the green comes in now these they recommended that are very good for um, terrariums fairy gardens things like that and from what I've seen when I uh, looked up some pictures of these these can make good hanging plants too so I think eventually that's what I'm gonna do I'm gonna put them both together have it grow some more and put it in a hanging pot too but um, I'm really happy with these they came in really good shape again the soil is moist I haven't had to water these at all and packaged very well so those were the two plants that I got from Hertz Gardens and again I'll leave the link down below now this one is similar in texture too this one I got at Home Depot and let me just take it out of the I have not planted it into the terracotta pot yet but you can see here the texture on these this is a polia involucrata and it enjoys low light which I have plenty of that in my apartment but again almost similar design and that texture to it and I don't know if you can catch it with the light there but it has a real shimmery effect to the leaves really pretty satiny shimmery look to it again these are good for terrariums also um, for right now I'm going to leave it in this little pot just like that and eventually I'll transplant it into this terracotta pot that's the Palea Involucrata. Really pretty. And the last one, back up just a little bit here, is a begonia, begonia rex. This was next to the polia and there was a section of plants that they were recommending for um, terrariums, fairy gardens, things like that. And I saw this and I just, again, the foliage is just so beautiful. Just love the texture of it, but the deep colors. It's such a dark maroon that it almost looks black. And then the red on it and the red in the back. So it's a beautiful specimen of Rex begonia. You can see the little hairs on the stems there. Just gave it a drink of water this morning because it was looking just a tad droopy, so I did give it a drink of water this morning. But it's just beautiful. And I got this nice, pretty terracotta pot that I'm gonna plant it in. It's just sitting in it for right now. So these are my latest house plants. And I know I said I wasn't gonna buy anymore because I'm gonna be moving soon and just, you know, moving plants is not the best thing or the easiest thing to do, but I just, I just couldn't help myself, friends. The addiction is real, the struggle is real, isn't it? So those are my newest house plants. Hope you enjoyed this video, friends. If you did, please do give it a thumbs up. I would so much appreciate that. And I will leave down below in the comments uh, or in the description box uh, links to uh, Hertz Gardens Etsy shop. And um, again, if you have any advice on how to best care for my uh, Pelea, I would so appreciate it. Thanks so much, friends. Have a blessed day.